Hello. Yeah, T60. Yeah, that is a lot better of power armor right there. Look at that. Door open. We're free. And voila. Here we are. And People of the Commonwealth. Do not interfere. Our intentions are peaceful. What? We are the Brotherhood of Steel. Um... Okay... Deep into that darkness, peering at it. Long I stood there, wondering, fearing. What the fuck is going on here? Alright, military frequency, what's going on? At least... Yeah, what's going on in this military frequency? Okay. Repeating. We got a lot of stuff to do then. Huh. All Brotherhood of Steel units are to return to the Cambridge Police Station immediately for reassignment. Alright. Let's head back to the police station because Repeating. I want to see this. And I want to know why the Brotherhood of Steel seems to be invading. Apparently, I am kind of in a state of shock because what the fuck is going on? This is not what I expected at all. This is the last thing I expected. A fuck. Holy shit. I hope they're going to be cool with the Minutemen existing and everything. Wait, does the Brother of Steel... The Brother of Steel hates the Institute. So this could be good for us. Right? I sure as fuck hope so. If not, I don't know. Speaking of that, just in case, I feel like there might come a time where a persuasion check might be necessary. And as such, what I want to do very quickly before anything happens is I am throwing some points into our charisma. Because we want to get to level 9 charisma anyway. But uh, just in case, we got some persuading that needs to be done. Who are you? Hope they don't mistake us. You must have spent a whole case of ammo holding this site. Suppose that means we missed all the fun. No yeah. What is going on? I mean, thank God I talked to the Brother of Steel first and they don't like hate me or anything. That's kind of good. Yo, Paladin Dance, what the fuck Paladin is going on? Cavalry's arrived. And it looks like they sent in the big guns. Uh I'm impressed. That ship. I've never seen anything like it. Amazing, isn't it? We call our ship the Pridwin. She's loaded with enough troops and supplies to mount a major offense. Can we take down? If uh... she's here, Elder Maxon's here, and that means we're going to war. against the Institute. Um. After rolling that thing in, you've certainly started a war. No one brings that much firepower without plans to use. Yeah. It. If history's proven anything. It's that an overwhelming show of force has a chance of halting a conflict before it begins. Besides, why should we hold back when we have something like that at our disposal? I like the way he thinks. That being said, you're about to get to know the Pridwin up mm? close and personal. I've received orders that we're both to report to her immediately. Hello! Follow me up to the roof of the police station. We're going for a little ride. Mm. I am pretty happy that I decided. Move like you got a I'm pretty excited that we at least did some brotherhood stuff so that we're a part of the brotherhood and you know we get to partake in this. This is this Unless is cool. Like getting radiation sickness. I'd stay away from Feral. Call Esperance. Can open that door there, dance. I can't really can't really go to Cambridge when you're in the way. Big guy. Can't really seemingly open the door at all now that you opened it. There we go. That was weird. Do you get to take a ride in the vertebird? 
Because if so, holy crap. That is crazy. Yeah, we get to ride in the vertibird, boys! Woohoohoo! That right there, that's that good shit. Oh, can I mount the gun? I want to mount the gun. Flying around in a 200 year old aircraft? <laughs> what could go that wrong? That minigun in front of you is loaded and ready to fire. Oh, yes. During the flight. I suggest you put it to good use. Oh, yes. You properly identify your target before you start shooting. We don't want to have any mishaps to fire on the local. Oh, my God. This is amazing. I, I, I'm like so giddy on the inside right now. This is awesome. This is so awesome. The Commonwealth looks different from up here. Doesn't yeah, it? yeah, it does. Never ceases to amaze me how drastically your perception of the battlefield changes from the air. We're gonna need that edge when we take on the institute. Yeah, fuck the institute. They've already proven that they're technologically superior, which means there's no telling what types of weapons they'll have in their arsenal. Hopefully, our air superiority and tactical know-how will make the difference. And before they whip out a bigger ship. Anyone on that boat? No? Any hostiles to shoot? Can I just say my frames are surprisingly low riding in this shit? Like... Everyone down there believed in our cause. But they've been blinded by rumors and misinformation. They don't realize that the Brotherhood of Steel is the Commonwealth's last hope for survival. It might very well be. Brother of Steel, I've loved you guys in like every Fallout game. I will support you unless you take away my settlements in the Minutemen. So, just saying. The Pridwin should be coming into view just ahead. We'll be meeting Lancer Captain Kells on the flight deck. Just stick close to me and answer all of his questions. Will do. Is that a fucking pirate ship? Why, hello, pirate ship. How you doing? Is that a robot? What the fuck is that shit? Hmm. Don't want to shoot anything on accident and piss someone off. I ain't about that. There's a Pridwin. Oh boy. This is exciting. We got to take a ride in a vertibird. Now that is some sick shit. I haven't shot anyone yet though. I've been a little bit too cautious here. Should I have shot someone? Maybe. I mean, there's the airport that people were talking about. Or like the landing strip. It's coming up right on us. There you go, Boston Airport. Hey, I've landed here before when I went to PAX. Look at that. Is this thing gonna land in Boston Airport? Where did this thing even come from now that I think about it? That's a fantastic question, because holy crap. That is some air superiority, man. This is insane. <gasps> where's where's Liberty Prime? Is Liberty Prime here? Liberty! We need you! The hero of Fallout 3 must come to Fallout 4. I'm ready. Oh boy. Oh boy, to say the least. Where the fuck are we landing? This ain't no flight deck. This is the under deck. Oh, there we go. Now it's going verdi. Damn. Oh shit, what was that? What's, what's going on? It's a scary noise. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Okay. Have you ever wondered where old planes go to die? Do I just get off? Paladin dance. There's Lancer Captain Kelp. Follow me. How do I How do I get off? Just hold E. There we go. Okay. I mean, something happened. I got off somehow. Don't know if that was my doing, that was their doing. All aboard the Pridwin. Nick, get out of the way, please. Permission to come aboard, sir? Permission granted. And welcome back. Allow me to be the first to congratulate you on a successful mission. And is this our new recruit? Yeah. Yes, sir. I feel promoted him to initiate, and I'd like to sponsor his entry into our rankings personally. Yes, we've read your reports. You'll be pleased to know that Elder Maxon's approved your request to place the recruit in your charge. Oh, hell yeah. Thank you, sir. And my current orders? You are to remain on the Pridwin and await further. Oh, hell no. Very good, sir. Ad Victorium, Captain. Ad Victorium. Ad Victorium. Yeah. Do I talk to you now? Kels. So, 
You're the one Paladin Dance has taken under his wing. <laughs> you don't look much like a soldier to Fine, shit out of me some more. Looks can be deceiving. Which is precisely why I personally insist on scrutinizing every recruit who boards this vessel. I've read Paladin Dance's reports. He seems to think you'll make a fine addition to the Brotherhood. You might expect an endorsement like that to grant you a great deal of latitude with us. But let me make one thing clear. The Brotherhood of Steel has traveled to the Commonwealth with a specific goal in mind. As the captain of this vessel, I won't allow anyone to jeopardize our mission, no matter how valuable they think they are. Understood? I mean, I'm down. What's the mission? What exactly is your mission here? I'm not at liberty to say. Elder Maxon will be addressing the crew shortly, and I'm certain all of your questions will be answered. Now, was there anything else, or was everything I said understood? Understood, sir. Not even a hint? Not even a hint? Come on. I have a lot you of charisma. It. Look, all I can tell you is that we're here directly in response to the data that Dance's recon team provided us. Beyond that, you'll just have to wait until Elder Maxon addresses the crew. Now dispense with the questions. It's time to get to work. Understood? That's all for now, soldier. Your orders are to proceed to the command deck for the address. After which, Elder Maxon wishes to have a word with you. If you have any questions, ask me now. Otherwise, you're dismissed. Will do. No questions. I don't have any questions. Then I suggest you head over to the command deck immediately. To the command deck this we go. Hell yeah, I was gonna go do some story stuff. Hell no, nah, we got this shit to do. This is about 20 times cooler. We're aboard a ship full of people with power armor. This is, oh my god, this is insane. Talk about a plot twist. I wasn't even expecting this shit. Is that, hello, hello, sir. How you doing? Brothers and sisters, the road behind has been long. Oh, he's got some good ass facial hair. Difficulty. Each and every one of you has surpassed my expectations by rapidly facilitating our arrival in the Commonwealth. You have accomplished this amazing feat without a hint of purpose or direction. And most impressively, without question. Now that the ship is in position, it is time to reveal our purpose and our mission. Fuck up the Institute? The Commonwealth, there is a cancer known as the Institute. A malignant growth that needs to be cut before it infects the surface. They are experimenting with dangerous technologies that could prove to be the world's undoing for the second time in recent history. The Institute scientists have created a weapon that transcends the destructive nature of the atom what? bomb. They call their creation oh, the Synth. Okay. A robotic abomination of technology that is free thinking and masquerades as a human being. This notion that a machine could be granted free will is not only offensive, but horribly dangerous. And like the atom, if it isn't harnessed properly, it has the potential of rendering us extinct as a species. I am not prepared to allow the Institute to continue this line of experimentation. Therefore, the Institute and their Synths are considered enemies of the Brotherhood of Steel and should be dealt with swiftly and mercilessly. This campaign will be costly and many lives will be lost. But in the end, we will be saving humankind from its worst enemy. Itself. Ad Victorium. Ad Victorium. Ad Victorium. Ad Victorium. Ad Victorium. If you're looking for another safe haven. What's up, Elder? Elder Maxon? I care about them, you know. The people of the Commonwealth. I can see that. I can see that. They're playing with fire and we need to save them. Exactly. I just hope we're here in time. I refuse to allow the mistakes of the past to be repeated. What do you want? What do you want from me? I want you to start taking responsibility for this planet. To start making a difference. Just trying to save and trees or some shit? Paladin Dance's reports, you've already begun that journey. Seeing as he's one of my most respected field officers, you couldn't get a better recommendation. Therefore, from this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of knight. Fuck yeah. And befitting your time, <sighs> we're granting you a suit of power armor to protect you on the field of battle. Where, is this like uh, better power armor? Um, I'll do my best. I'll do my best to live up to it. I'm certain that you will. In any event, once you're finished becoming familiar with the Pridwin and my staff, report to the flight deck for your new orders. 
Welcome aboard the Pridwin soldier. Make us proud. And Victorium. Yeah. Damn right. Personal storage container. This is gonna be cool. Is he is Nick welcome aboard here? He's uh he's kind of, you know, a synth. Is that allowed? Yo, real quick, low key. Oh, I can't pickpocket the fuck. I was gonna say, does he have a cool weapon or some shit? I know, that's an awful thought, but hey. Hey, I think, you know? I think. Also, what's this with this pistol that's uh Kellogg's pistol. This uses, uses 44 ammo. That's strong as hell. Refuel, refills your action points on a critical hit. Damn, son. Now that is crazy. Uh, right away and a gold flip lighter. Is, is there a store somewhere here? I gotta sell some shit some, somewhere. That's Kells. I believe you are needed elsewhere right now. We can talk. I gotta find where I can sell some shit. Cause I feel like these guys are gonna have some fantastic weapons for me to buy. Cause this is the fucking Brotherhood. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, bruh. Thank you, thank you. Holy shit. What's going on down there? Those are, okay, no, that's the good guys. The fuck are they shooting at? Yeah, exactly what are they shooting at here? Something there? Oh, I see his brother down there. The fuck are they shooting at? I don't even know. Is that something? If dumb and ugly had a child, it'd be a super. Mm-hmm. I agree with that, girlfriend. Alright, where are we heading to now? We gotta board that thing? No. No, it's something up here. Yeah. Wait. Why'd I leave them? Shouldn't we stay on the command deck? Did I take like a wrong exit or something? Oh, I did. Oh, ladder. Oh, the flight deck. That would make sense. Now let's go to the main deck. This is where the good shit's gonna be going on. Let's see what is up on up here. After a hopefully short loading screen. Nothing too long. Status report. Green across the board, sir. Nothing new. Good. Carry on. Nice. Let's carry on. Carry on. Anyone I can sell shit with, please. So how did it look out there? We've got a lot of work <coughs> ahead of us, brother. Some patching up. Go see Night Captain. Damn it. All right, what's up, Dance? Dance. There you are. How did it go with Elder Man? I'm a knight. He's dedicated. He's a very dedicated man. It sounds like he stands behind everything he's saying. Of course he does. How could he afford not to? I just hope you appreciate how much of a chance I'm taking bringing you into the fold this quickly. Not to put too fine a point on it, but if you screw up, we go down together. Won't let you down. I won't let you down, Dance. I promise. Good. Now, I know you're eager to hop into a suit of power armor and take the fight to the Institute. But first things first. In order to be an effective part of the team, you need to learn your way around this ship and get to know its crew. Do I have to play like 21 questions with them or something? You your sponsor, I'd recommend taking me along. Hold way. up. I get Dan's as a companion Sounds now? Good. Let's go. Outstanding. Oh, fuck yeah, this is by far the best companion. Yo, Nick, you're chilling at the castle. That's where everyone chills, my friend. Hope you're cool with that, Nick. Lancer initiate. Where's my... There's a wealth of technology just waiting to be discovered on. Yeah, where's my personal locker at, though? Kind of would like to know that. There. Try it now. Nothing. I'm supposed to report 10 minutes ago. Hold up, hold up. We got some data here. Discuss your findings, troubled waters. Let's do that shit. Where's my personal locker, by the way? I'm trying to figure that out. Is this it? Let's not steal that. Oh, that's T60. Oh, shit. That's way better power armor. Not what I was expecting. Uh, handle myself. I can handle myself. Hey, if Paladin Dance vouched for you, that's good enough for me. You just don't look like one of the usual wastelanders we pick I'm up. I'm better. Anyway, since you came down here to meet me, we may as well get it over with. My name's Ingram, and this lovely little grease pit is where you'll usually find me. If your power armor's too tight in the crotch, the Pridwin's about to crash into the ground, or a robot's gone haywire, you come see me. Oh, is that, is that flirty? Charm school? You should add teaching charm school lessons to the list. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but when you're as busy as I am, there isn't much time for bowing and curtsy. Can I bang there you, though? There isn't a day that goes by on this tub without five or six things breaking Take down. Take that as a no. And since I'm stuck in this rig, I'm not quite as spry as I used to be. 
The work tends to pile up. Uh, I hardly notice. I hardly noticed. Hmm. Can't tell if you're patronizing me or trying to be polite. Aww. How about I just forget you mentioned it? Anyway, I'm sure you're here to get your hands on some power armor. Yes. There's a pretty decent <gasps> suit sitting in bay three that's all yours. The left leg actuator's a bit sticky, but it'll keep the creeps off of you. A T60? Oh, if you need any work done on it, feel free to use the workshops around here. Are we using T45 so before? Excuse me. I need to get back to work. This is about 20 times better. Can I just uh, just, just say that real quick? That's uh, Where's Bay 3? Bay 4? The Commonwealth looks bad. Oh, fuck. Hello. Yeah, T60. Yeah, that is a lot better of power armor right there. Look at that. That, my friends, is what I like to see. I'd be the first one to kick them open. Look at that now bad boy. Locked and loaded. Oh shit. What the hell did I do there? Oh no. Sorry. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> yeah, look at that though. Now that, my friends. That's the sign of a badass. This right here. This power armor. This is how you know it's me. It's as badass as it gets. It's beautiful. It's bloody, bloody beautiful. Freaking T60 power armor. That's the best shit. All right, let's hop back in first person. We got a full fusion core, and uh, let's impress some people. Oh, this frame is driving me crazy. I've got like three itches. I can't I'll scratch them for you if you catch my drift. Step forward, Knight. Even though they've locked me in this blasted cage, I promise that I won't. Oh, do they have Goss rifles here? Yo. Why are you in there? I'm glad you asked. Now this is the stowage depot, and I, as you probably already guessed, am the ship's quartermaster. Proctor Tegan. The powers that be have me locked in here, so I can keep an eye on the Brotherhood's valuables. If you need to stock up on supplies before you head out on a mission, this is the place to buy them. You might have a Goss rifle. Um, good to know. That's good to know. I'm glad you're the agreeable type. When I tell most of the new recruits that they have to buy their own equipment, they give me the stink eye. No problem, Tegan. I got you. By having a constant flow of caps, I'm able to buy whatever you bring Even better. Me. Yeah, I'm mostly interested in weapons, but I'll take anything. Again, I got an abundance of drugs usually. If you're just looking to make a few caps on the side, I might have some extra work for you to do. That is good. That is good. Extra work. What sort of extra work are we talking about? Oh, no, 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 no. It's nothing like you're thinking. It just involves a little bit of heavy lifting and... Interacting with the local farms. And since I'm stuck up here manning this one man zoo, I need someone to do the legwork for me. After you're done with the meet and greet, we can discuss the details. In the meantime, if you ever need anything else, gun, a mod, even ammo, you just let me know. Sounds good with me, my friend, so Tegan. Remember, come find me when you're done meeting. God the damn it, I wanted to buy shit. Just shenanigans. I don't want to talk to people. I just want to buy things. Hopefully a Goss rifle, because those Joining things were dope the from the life, past fallouts, and we've yet to see a Goss rifle. So, just saying. This is Med Bay. I'll take that as a yes. Glad you finally stopped by, soldier. Are you ready for your medical Sure. Exam? Sure. Sure. Go right ahead. All right. I'm going to ask you a series of medical-related questions, and I'd like you to answer me to the best of your ability. Uh -huh. First question. As a child, were you ever exposed to radiation for an extended period of time? Nope. Before the war. There wasn't that much radiation around before the bombs fell. Before the bombs? What? Let, let me check my notes. You were a vault dweller? Mm -hmm. You're probably healthier than anyone else aboard. Anyway, sorry I missed that in your records. Just going down the list of questions. I'm sure you understand. Mm -hmm. Okay, second question. Have you ever had or come in contact with a person confirmed to be carrying a communicable Is disease? Is stupidity a communicable disease? Never been seriously sick in my life. Good, good. Third question. And please, answer honestly. Have you ever had sexual relations with any species considered non-human? Um, I want to know if that happens that often. Happens often enough for you to have a question about it? You'd be surprised how many wastelanders answer yes to that question. 
Fortunately, the Brotherhood finds that type of behavior absolutely distasteful. Since you haven't spent too much time in the Wasteland, I'll assume your answer is no. Last question. Would you have any problems pulling the trigger on an enemy of the Brotherhood, whether they're human, formerly human, or machine? No. Nope. No problem whatsoever. Excellent. You'll fit in quite well around mm -hmm. here. Excellent. I think I've got all the information I like need. Like I said, excellent. Twice. I see no reason to prevent you from beginning your duties immediately. If you ever need medical assistance, you let me know. Sounds good. One person left to talk to, and then we're Gucci. Who is this? Ah, oh, good. You're finally here. Just set the books down anyway. Oh, it's a brick then, I'll is it? To them as soon as I can. Something like that. It's a little bit of British accent there. Yeah, I think you're confused a little bit there. Uh, I think you're last. confusing me with someone else. A lad? Hmm. Perhaps I need to rummage through the supply bins for a new Perhaps pair of glasses. Perhaps you do there. Since it's obvious that you aren't who I was expecting, would you mind telling me why you're here? Uh, I actually just got here. I'm meeting the crew. Maxon wanted me to meet the crew, so you were next on my list. Ah, yes. You must be the new recruit described in Paladin Dance's That would be me. Under normal circumstances, I'd provide you with a proper orientation of my department. However, I'm woefully behind setting up research patrols and getting bombarded with requests for technical documentation. Unfortunately, I'm lacking the personnel needed to get the job done. Uh, I could help. Maybe I can lend you a hand. That would be splendid. As you patrol the Commonwealth, keep your eyes open for blueprints, memos, manuals, books, charts. Anything containing useful technical data. I'm authorized to pay you for each bundle of documents that you recover. And if you wish to be assigned to a research patrol, I have plenty of them waiting to be filled. In any event, it was a pleasure to meet you, Knight. Same here. Collect technical documents. Got it. We good? We're done here. Tour of duty completed. Got another level. I think we hit 17. You know what that means? I think we actually unlock a pretty nice perk at 17. So hola, hola. I think what we can do here, I think it was level 2 of the science perk per chance. Yes, we can get level 2 of the science perk. However, I want to keep going and get the freaking... What is it? Not nerd rage. Oh shit, did I go up in the wrong... Don't tell me I've been going up in intelligence on accident this entire time. No, we've been going up in charisma. Good. Good. My dumbass would probably go up in that. Oh, my companion can do more damage. All right, well, I want to get that Wasteland Whisper. And let's go ahead, Charisma. Confirm that selection. And our next level, we should be able to be a Wasteland Whisperer. That is going to be interesting. <laughs> That's good stuff. All right, we completed tour duty. Um, we got a new quest, or what's up, what's up? Show no mercy, Elder Maxon. Alright, we'll talk with Maxon here in a second. Do some of that jazz. First things first, I want to talk with you, see what guns you got. Bruh. Proctor Teagan. What brings you to me? Guns! I'll take a look. All of my weapons are mission ready. Goss rifle, please tell me you have a Goss rifle. Please. They don't have Goss rifles in this game? That is weak sauce. That is really weak sauce. These guns actually kind of focus boosted laser right. Yeah, these guns like. Why would a missile launcher have a bayonet? Can someone elaborate that on me? Hello, combat armor chest piece. Ooh, brotherhood of steel. I like that. Is, is this better than what we currently have? It might be. Might be. Ooh, commando chest piece. Commando helmets. Increases action point refresh speed. That seems like. It's a very good chest piece, actually, and this is Brotherhood of Steel Tech 2, so... Alright, I'll see if I can't sell you some shit here real quick. See if you want to take anything I got. Take my grenades, uh, take this pipe pistol, you can... It's an extra fat man, so honestly, go ahead and take it, my friend. It's all yours. Take all of those nades, all of those. Uh, I got you an Institute rifle. That pistol's staying with me. That's gonna be my use of 44 ammo. Got some pulse grenades, pulse mine, and a switchblade for you. There you go. We're doing pretty hot there money-wise. I can get you Kellogg's outfit because I don't plan on using that at all. Patrolman sunglasses doesn't matter. I think that's the leg I still have to equip, which I haven't equipped yet for some reason. 
Uh, go ahead, take some buff out, take some jets, my mentats. Uh, I kind of want to sell you some of my Nuka Colas. I'm keeping the Quantums, though, to be fair. Orange mentats, purified water, which I have never used before, so that's another 140 caps. Take the stealth boys, take my Yao Guai. Honestly, I could sell you the quantum, but those things give an insane amount of health, so no thank you. Um, these actuators. Do I sell them? I mean, I hope. No, I'm gonna let you guys let me know in the comment section if I need those for later. If so, I will not sell them. If yes, I will sell the fuck out of them. Or, I, no, other way, other way. Uh, I think I got that backwards. Whoops. Uh, San Francisco Sunlights. I don't need those shits. No reason for those. Uh, vault Tech Launch Box. Still keeping that. Robco Fun. Keeping those. My junk, my junk, my junk, my junk. Anything good? Nuclear material on those things. Uh, I want to sell some, like, cigarette boxes. Do I have cigarette boxes? Cigar box. Those things are kind of good for selling in the first place. Gold plated flip lighters. Industrial oil canister. Eh, it's got aluminum though. Aluminum's pretty good stuff. Lantern. Eh, Nuka Cola bottles. Pack of cigs. Take all of them. Take all that pre war. Those boat fragments will come in handy. And I think that we are good to go. I got some extra mods here. I don't really plan on doing anything with the laser musket. My double barrel shotgun. That's just like that standard shit. Alright, give you all that. Now then. I want something in return. Oh, yeah, do you have any good weapon mods? Not really. No, those those suck. Those suck. Quite a little bit, actually. All right, what we can get here, though, is some very nice armor. And I can get the Brother of Steel uniform, but it's not a big deal. And then we could pick up those if we wanted to. So there's actually pretty good armor, I'm not gonna lie. Did we just pick up the entire set? We can afford, like, a commando chess piece. I, I like that. Yeah, we'll take... This bad boy first. We'll take the chest piece. And uh, I'll buy the helmet. Yay? No, okay, let's let me see real quick. Sorry that this is taking a little bit. Uh, apparel wise. Army helmet versus this helmet. I'm taking this helmet. Um what else do we have here? Army helmets, uh, Brother of Steel stuff, black room glasses. My left arm has 15 armor, that left. Okay, this is just legs. Uh, metal right leg, combat armor right leg, I'm taking that. Uh, where's my left leg? My wastelander chest piece, I can sell this. Ooh, ooh, I can sell that, get some extra value out of it. Actually, maybe, hold up, hold up, hold up. I might be able to man do a little bit of maneuvering here. Uh, take the... My army helmet. Uh, I'm gonna fuck this up somehow. Take this fucking leg for all I care. So what I want to do is I want to get that special commando helmet. And I gotta make up a 200 cap difference somehow. Oh boy. Oh boy. How am I gonna do this? Hmm. Could summon the champion left arm, but probably not. Combat helmet. Oh yeah, take your helmet back. So I'm not gonna be using that. Uh, I could sell you... Yeah, I could... Honestly, sell them some of these. I'll sell you a couple of my quantums. Uh, you can take my med X. Take some of my rad X. I don't really use that much of it. And uh, there we go. Okay, and then I want to get the left leg. And did I buy the right leg too? I think so. I don't know. And uh, yeah, it's looking, it's looking about good. All right, let's accept that. And we should be a hell of a lot more armored up. We also do have an extra perk point? No, we don't. Okay. Let's go to our inventory now. We got our apparel. Cannot equip this fallen power armor. Let's get out of the power armor real quick. Put on some better clothes. Uh, oh, because everyone apparently hates the rags that I live in. I'll go ahead and buy some, buy some, Set me buy up. some extra All stuff here. Mission ready. Good to hear, Tegan. All right. Because apparently everyone thinks that I look so ugly in my current uniform, I'll buy fucking Brotherhood of Steel Uni. How's that sound? Does that sound good? All right, that's that's what I like to hear. Well, what can I sell to this guy? Is it, uh, Chappa Dabba Doo? I don't know. Can I sell him? I can sell him another two, like Rad X. I'll sell you two of them. There you go. Accept, there we go. 
I have a better armor. And now with everything that we equip, check this out. We got our right leg, we got a new right leg, we got a uniform. We got the commando helmet and the commando chest piece, which is going to be awesome for that. And uh, look at that. Now we're looking not like a hobo, according to everyone who's commented on my videos. So yay. Where's that? Uh, we had uh, some good thing here. Raider leathers. That gives us more armor? Really? Leathers gives us more armor. All right, I'm not, I'm not judging. Champion left arm. We have everything. Wait, I don't know why our arms look different. All right, let's get back into this. Get back to walking around. We have plenty of fusion cores anyway, so like I care. We can walk around in this shit all damn day if I want. And let's go talk to that guy up there. Uh, gamma rounds. Ten. I'm taking all of that. Thank you. Thank you. I can sell it back to you if I wanted to, but I'm not that much of a dick. Oh, hello. Hello. Is this where the supplies are? No? Alright, let's start running then. Eh! 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 Hey, a Nuka Cola Quantum! Look at that! Already worth it. And a cigarette carton. And a cigar box. And vodka. And a recreation terminal. Oh, is that where I can play the stupid mini game? If so, I'm gonna have to get around to that next time. I gotta make a mountain though, because we unlocked a mini game. And god damn it, I'm gonna play that freaking mini game one day and just see how like dumb or amazing it is. Who knows? Let's get back to the command deck. Let's see what awaits us here. He wants to give us a mission, right? Do we have to equip the mission first? No, he's, he's out here apparently. All right, let's head on out here. I mean, we have a beautiful set of power armor right now, so this is looking awesome as all hell. And as long as we can get out of here, whoops. All right, where are you? Oh, is he gonna be up there? That'd probably make sense. Oh no, he's back here. All right, what's up, man? Elder. Now that you've familiarized yourself with the Cribbins crew, are you ready for your next assignment? Oh yeah, time for action. Just point me to the action. I applaud your enthusiasm, Knight. Let's get right to it then, shall we? Take a look over there. That's Fort Strong, and it's infested with. The fucking island. Having those aberrations of nature close enough to smell is making me sick to my stomach. To make matters worse. They're sitting on top of a massive <gasps> stockpile of fat man shells we could use in yes. our campaign. I want you to head over there, wipe out everything that moves, and secure that Can I secure it for myself? Understood? Um, consider it done. Wait, the fat man shells. What do these shells do? The fat man launcher is an essential part of the Brotherhood arsenal. It's a miniature nuclear payload in a man portable format. A squad of troops armed with one of these is virtually He's unsafe. right. If you ever have the pleasure of firing them, Allow me to give you Stay a word away. of advice. Don't fire one of them in close quarters. There won't be enough of you to bury in a shoebox. Is that enough to Yeah, go that's good. Consider it done. Consider it done. Look, I realize you're eager to take the fight to the Institute, but it'll have to wait. The Brotherhood cannot allow those abominations to have a nuclear arsenal at their He does have a good tips. point. It'll be a pleasure to exterminate that mutant filth. Now, we have a vertebrate on standby, fully armed and ready to depart. Use it to carry our message to Fort Strong, and wipe those dirty mutants from the face of the earth. Dismiss. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Unfortunately, it's gotta wait till next time. I'm sorry, guys, but I've been in corner for a while here, and uh, things are getting juicy. But alas, we must wait until the next video to head on over to Fort Strong and wipe that shit out and do the Brotherhood some service. But uh, that is going to go ahead and do it for me for now, though. So come on back next time to watch some awesome gameplay of us uh, taking that bad boy down. That's going to be fun. But other than that, that is going to go ahead and do it for me for now, though. So thank you guys so much for watching the video, as always. And hopefully, I'll see you in the next one.